Hi guys, my name is David Tenorio. I'm an artist here in the Bay Area in California. In this video, we're going to be working on a watercolor portrait drawing together. We've got a really great reference photo that gives us a lot of exciting opportunities to check out skin tones, colors in hair, um, and even some really bright, great color in clothing and fabric. So let's go ahead and check it out. Primarily get, you know, just water. Then with water, I'll come in and I'll, I'll kind of soften, especially the edges, some edges of the shape. And this might mean I even make, um, honestly, what we refer to as like the midtones, like a little bit like the midtone. But watercolor at its best, I would say, you know, there's like quite a bit of things I would say like help watercolor perform or like look really cool, you know, make it look amazing. But part of it at its best is it's a combination of soft and sharp edges. And that's painting in general. That's not just limited to watercolor. Painting in general would be a really great um, synthesis, like a, a series, a mixture of soft and sharp edges. So I'm just looking for some little moments here and there. Especially where you feel the the shapes are soft, like for instance in a cheek, that that turn is really soft. And I'm just laying some clean water, especially next to or like near the edge of one of those original pieces, so that I can soften some edges and also drag a little bit of that uh, kind of thin color into the other areas. Uh, what we refer to as midtone, midtone being you know not not purely highlight, but then not in shadow. Um, I can't forget that this would also, it's worth dragging into the ear. The ear's pretty dark. And again, we'll, we'll come back with another shot of color to deepen some of these shadows. Um, also, this is a good time you can throw a little bit of like heat, like a little bit of red. So I was using the um, burnt umber and quin rose is like my base, and then even grabbing a little bit of the cadmium red. Uh, I I mentioned in one of the other times that I taught watercolor that I am uh, I'm far from the person to like just be saying all the colors while I'm painting. It kind of reminded me of like a football play, like saying all these like you know cad red, burnt umber, you know cobalt blue. <laughs> um, so I apologize if I use a color and I don't say it out loud, or if I use a color and it's actually not the one, etc. Um, you know, I, I do what I can. <laughs> so I'm coming over here and I'm, I'm also just like very, very softly, like pushing into this ear just to kind of like really blow the edge out a little bit. Um, so that was as clean as I could get. It's not gonna be perfectly clean, but some clean water and then kind of just letting that blow away or blow out. <laughs> 